Yeah, it's a, uh, it's, 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 it's a failure. You know, uh, <clears throat> in spring training, we talked about winning the division and, you know, putting ourselves in a good spot in the postseason, you know, to win a World Series, and um, we came up short. You know, we set out uh, to win the whole thing, and uh, to come up short, it's not a good feeling. But the work never ends, and we'll uh, continue to try and, I guess, close that gap or um, put ourselves in a position to get over the hump. And, you know, I know everyone in our room <clears throat> believes we will. And the Yankees <laughs> have not been to a World Series in an entire calendar decade for the first time in over a century. Do you have access to the highest payroll if necessary? Get somebody. I think there is one player on out of the 50 guys that played the ALCS that tipped the scales, and that's Garrett Cole. If Garrett Cole was not on the Astros, I think the Yankees win that series. As long as the Astros don't sign Garrett Cole, I think they, the Yankees still have a better team. Made the trip to the West Coast to do it, and it, by all indications, Jack, it sounds like they had a very positive meeting with Cole. You know, when, you know we'll have a lot of battle scars uh, when we do finally get to the top of that mountain. It really gives me great pleasure today to kind of publicly and officially welcome Garrett and Amy to our Yankee family. I would just like to say, I'm here, I've always been here.